if you took three walks a week or more, you were 30% less likely to develop dementia in the next five years. We know that physical activity is releasing, a whole, every single time you move your body, you're releasing a whole bunch of neurochemicals in your brain. Some of them make you just feel good. Serotonin, dopamine, noradrenaline, endorphins. Yeah, I feel good. If I go out for a walk, I feel better than if I had been sitting here for eight hours. But the other thing that gets released every single time is growth factors. I like to call it a bubble bath of neurochemicals that happens every time you move your body. What that growth factor does is it goes directly into your hippocampus and it helps brand new cells grow in your hippocampus. The hippocampus is only one of two total brain areas where new cells can grow. That's not the same as synapses, which are connections in the cells that are already there, but the hippocampus can grow new cells. And this is really important because many people know that the hippocampus is attacked first in Alzheimer's dementia. And so exercise is not going to eliminate that disease state, but it's going to take that disease that much longer to actually damage enough of your hippocampus so that you start seeing those telltale signs of memory impairment that comes with uh, Alzheimer's disease.